Yo, what's up boys? It's Benji. Welcome back to another video. Today it's Waterford away. I'm looking forward to this one. Obviously, we're already champions. Um hopefully the tempo doesn't drop. Hopefully we still go for the jugular, go for the three points, finish off the season um even stronger. Uh, I'm heading down on my own today. Um Dylan usually goes with me, he's sick. So I'm going down on my own. I'm staying down in Waterford today. So this is my first away game game on my own. Uh, I've only been to like one Rovers game actually on my own without the lads, and that was Drogheda start of this season during COVID. Um, but I can't wait. I have to. It's a busy day today, so I had to. Um, I'm getting the NX from Navin into O'Connell Street, then getting the Lewis out to Houston, then getting the train from Houston to Waterford, which I think is the last stop, Plunkett Station, and then it's like a thirty minute walk to the Travel Lodge. Go in there, put down my stuff, go out, look for a pub, have a pint, and then go to the game. Fucking buzzing, boys. Hopefully get the three points today. It's a busy day. I'll bring you with me. And yeah, come on, Rovers. Don't let me down. Touchdown in Waterford, boys. We're here. That train was so fucking long. It was fucking packed. Um, There's about 20, 30 other Rovers fans on it. And uh, yeah, we're here now. But uh, walking to my hotel. Stay at the travel lodge, it's literally right beside the ground. I didn't even know that when I uh when I ordered it, but yeah, we're chilling. I think the travel lodge has a bar, so have a few pints before. Uh get ready. I brought jeans, I mean obviously I'm gonna wear the jeans, won't be wearing the trackies. But yeah, apparently the way end, we sold a lot of tickets today. So buzzing for that. Should be good crack. And yeah, come on the rovers, let's go. Boys, Google Maps take me down some fucking booky alleyways here. They said it's just half an hour walk. Fucking hell, I'm not even get there at this point. I feel like I'm about to get stabbed or something. I'm going to jump out from a fucking bush. Fucking hell. I'm setting off alarms now. I'm basically walking through people's back gardens. Like, fuck you, Google Maps. Anyway, it's... Um Score predictions today, boys. I think Rovers are going to win 3 1. I'm going to say goals from Gaffney and Maku and Gary Neal on the Rovers. Don't let me down. Okay, just out the pub. It was like a 25 minute walk from the Travel Lodge to the closest pub. Absolute fucking bollocks, boys. But anyway, we're chilling now and um, got to walk to the ground. Hopefully get in there in time. I kind of left it a bit late there. I was trying to down two pints and it just wasn't going. Because I haven't had any food today, so I'm fucking starving. But, um, yeah, I'll uh, cut to when we're in the ground. Champion, 
Playing in this city. I say go with me and you'll see a team in the famous hoops of Wood and Green. Their name is Rowers and we follow them home and away to victory. Half time, Waterford won Rovers nil. Um, yeah, eventful first half. Game got called off by 10 minutes. Lads loading fireworks at the back of the fucking shed. Choke. Um, I got hit in the head with a firework. I'm alright though. Um, I think it's just like the second part of the firework just kind of hit me in the back of the ear. I have a few burnt hairs, but besides that, I'm fine. Um, yeah, stupidity really. Rovers haven't got out of the blocks yet. Still, um, yet to really carve out a proper chance. We're getting in on the right hand side a lot. But there's no one there at the end, end, of, the, uh, end of the cross. Um, hopefully we can pick it up second half. I think these lads are going to go in and sit because they need the three points. And uh, yeah, we're going to hit them. But yeah, that's it.
keep the great flag flying on. We'll never die. We'll never die. We'll keep the green flag flying on. Shamrock Rovers will never die. We'll keep the green flag flying on. Right boys, game over. Waterford won, Rovers three. Um, the maddest away day I've ever been on. Poor in the first half and just totally dominant in the second half. That's why we're champions. Um, but the whole result, the whole day, I suppose my whole experience of going down on my own, all dampened by just the couple of lads that just ruined it for everyone else. Sorry, my voice is gone. Yeah, a couple of lads just just ruined it. Um, actually ended up getting hit in the head with a firework. Um, I'm all right. It's just my, the back of my ear. You kind of see it there. It's just completely red. It's just completely numb. I can't feel it. Um, but yeah, just a select minute, like a very 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 small minority that just constantly ruin it for everyone and it's it's sad because like we should be celebrating three points today in a nothing game really that's that's the most annoying thing it's it's a nothing game um like waterford need to win it rovers have already won the league it's just giving lads a run which we did do in the second half with a couple of young lads um but yeah just very upsetting going back tomorrow um about one o'clock is my uh my train so yeah um thanks for watching boys make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you're new and i'll see you in the next one the next video is going to be portugal at home or ireland and we're in the away end so it should be crazy thanks for watching boys in a bit <laughs>